For our homework solutions, we'll take this one bit at a time. Okay, we see first with A, we have three yards, four feet, and five yards. Notice we have different units here. What we want to do is convert so that we're all in the same unit. There are three feet in one yard, meaning if we have three yards, we have nine feet. Then we have four feet, 15 yards would be 15 feet. Now we're comparing the numbers 9, 4, and 15. Our longest side is 15. We have sides 9 and 4. But we should see that 9 plus 4 is 13. So these sides will never meet. In order to meet, they'd have to be at least 15 units. And to make a triangle, they'd have to be add to the number that's greater than 15. Meaning option A is out of the mix. Well, let's now look at option B. We have 3 yards, 5 feet, 8 feet. Again, we have different units. What we want to do is convert. We have 3 yards, and there's 3 feet in each yard. We have 9 feet, 5 feet, 8 feet. Well, our longest length is 9. We have 5, we have 8, 5 and 8 add together to be 13, which is greater than 9. That works. If this is just a multiple choice that's only looking for one answer, we could stop there. It's always good, though, to check the other options, make sure you didn't make a mistake, and that the other ones don't work either. Okay, we have 11 inches, 16 inches, 27 inches. Our longest side is 27. We have 11 and 16, which add to be 27 as well. So yeah, the sides will meet, but they're going to meet together on the length of 27. They're just going to create a straight line. It's not going to be a triangle. Option C is out. And lastly, we have 2 feet, 11 inches, 12 inches. Again, we have different units. We know there are 12 inches in a foot, meaning if we have 2 feet, we must have 24 inches. Our longest side is 24, with sides 11 and 12. 11 and 12 add to be 23. Again, those won't be able to meet, because they're not longer than this third side of 24. Well, it looks like we were right and that option B is the only correct response.